Okay, so the idea is to, to explain to the students what, what it means, IEEE, or what IEEE is, and what benefits can you gain uh, from, from if, you, if you get involved in the, the IEEE Magnetic Society. So, the, the IEEE uh, started, uh, let's say, uh, 150 years ago, more or less. Uh, you know that in the 19th century, the discovery of electricity was something very important for science and technology. And then the American Institute of Electrical Engineers appeared. And the first president was Norbert Green from Western Union. But other members of this society were Thomas Edison and Graham Bell representing the power and telephone industries. About 50 years uh, later, another important discovery was the transmission using uh, electromagnetic waves, radio. So the Institute of Radio Engineers was created. And uh, 50 years later, these two institutions merged and they created the IEEE, the Institute of Electrical and Electronics Engineers. Today is the largest technical professional organization for the advancement of technology. It has uh, uh, about, about uh, 400,000 members. Among them, more than 100,000 students. They belong to more than 160 countries. And more than 60% of these people are from outside uh, the United States. Ultramarine has uh, 39 technical societies and seven technical councils representing a wide range of uh, technological uh, subjects. And in particular, one of them, one of the technical societies is the Ultramarine Mathematics. It publishes about uh, 200 transaction journals and magazines. In particular, in the field of magnetism, there are two important journals, the, the Ultramarine Transaction Magnetics and the Ultramarine Magnetic Letter. And there is also a magnetic section in the Ultramarine Access which is an open access journal. And in fact, it has a higher impact factor than these two, two journals. So I don't know if you want to, to talk about this IEEE access uh, once again, because she's a member of the, of the committee of this journal. Uh, yes, well, very greatly, thank you. Uh, yes, I am the lead editor of the Magnetic Society section of IEEE access. This is a very fast publication. Access is a multidisciplinary journal, but because we have the Magnetic Society section, we have all reviewers, our reviewers who are experts in magnetics, so we can publish our magnetic papers here. And it's very fast. We, we give a, 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 a response in about four weeks, so that works really very fast. And there is a discount for any member of the Magnetic Society who wants to, to publish here. If you have a paper, or alternatively, if you want to be a reviewer for our magnetic section in the access, please do not hesitate to contact me. You will be very, very welcome. Thank you. And uh, besides journal, I probably a sponsor for uh, 100 and 1,600 conferences and events. And in magnetism, one famous conference is called the Intermat. And, uh, well, the Ultramarine Magnetic Society is one of these 39 technical societies. And uh, it was founded uh, about uh, 56 years ago. And it's managed by volunteers, so we are not earning any money from, from the Ultramarine, but we are supported by the professional uh, administration. And um, the mission is to promote the advancements of science and technology in the field of magnetism, and especially training. And, uh, if you become a member of the Magnetic Society, uh, you, can, you can have a reduction at the, at the peak of, of several conferences, such as the Internet. And it's uh, very important for a student because you can have access to the summer school and to the special projects. And I will tell you about this in a minute. And if you are a volunteer at the Magnetic Society, if you are involved in a committee, uh, of course, you can help to, to develop the organization and you can take decisions in the, in the society. So, regarding the summer school is something that is uh, held uh, every year during the, the summer here in the, in the North Hemisphere. And uh, support is provided for about 80 students. Uh, they, they have to send a proposal, which is a competitive application, and they can, uh, they can have free room and almost uh, free travel 
to where the conference where the summer school takes place uh, it lasts for about one week and the students from all parts of the world are, are welcome another important thing for the students and maria salvador uh, is one of this of this student uh, that is developing a, a project supported by the isoboni magnetic is this a special project for that or only for the students are for postdoctoral associates and um, those are collaborative projects so at least two institutions must be involved two students or one student and a postdoc or two postdocs from different institutions different countries and you can have uh, 10 10,000 uh, dollars per project and they last for one year and they so the good thing is that being a student or being a young postdoc you can be leading your own project. This is something very important for your CV. And uh, you don't need to be a IEEE member when you submit a proposal, but it's expected that you become a member if you, if you win one of these. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, another important thing that appeared this year was this uh, initiative also conducted by, by, by students. So, those uh, proposals were for dissemination activities that, uh, uh, that have to be lead and, and conducted by, by the students. So, Alvaro Gallo, Irene Morales, and Elena Hernandez made a proposal. The, the good thing about the ITFOD is that uh, all the proposals are short for the projects or for, for this initiative, for this dissemination initiative. It was a two page proposal only, and a, a couple of senior members helped them to include the proposal, but the original draft was already very good. And they won one of the, of the three awards. So they, they got $2,000 for this event. And that's why they, they can now give prizes for best presentation, best poster, the image contest. And also, they are, uh, they are offering travel grants and also memberships so all this money is from from these two two thousand uh, dollars that they they want with the proposal uh so please give them a, an applause. what i want to, to say so please join uh, I believe you <coughs> all of these ones to see that Okay, thank you. Thank you very much, uh, for sending it. Uh, 